everyone, it's Tiffany. I am here with the new Playmobil Advent Calendar, the Christmas Ball. So we're invited to celebrate the Christmas season with this Advent Calendar Christmas Ball with lots of exciting trinkets. Contains 24 surprise items for each day leading up till Christmas. Once all the pieces are revealed, you can enjoy a magical ball with the royal family. The set includes a backdrop, four figures, decorated tree, presents table, chair, candelabra, cat, kitten, violin, sleigh, and tons of other accessories. And this is available to purchase now. I want to thank Playmobil for sending this to me for free to open up with you guys today. I am really, really excited. It looks so cool. Basically, you can see, I would say, everything that you can get in this advent calendar here on the front and all laid out. It just looks so fun and magical. And I can't wait. And I love this little cat and the little basket. It's the best. And the tree, too, is pretty cool. Anyway. Enough talking about it. Oh, it says figures can rotate for dancing too. That's even cooler. But enough talking about it. Let's start getting this open. Inside the box, there was obviously the advent calendar and we have our little background, which we are going to check out right now quickly. If I can get it open. It is a cardboard background. Let's get it out. All right, so if we unfold it, okay, you can see this is the floor of the ball and then that's the background. So this is really nice. I'm gonna just set it up like this. Now you can't see unless I move the camera, but you know, you set this part on the floor and, or the ground or the table and then this goes up against the back or the wall or whatever you want to do. So we will, hmm, how are we going to do this? I think we'll keep this in the back and we will fill it up at the end, I think that's how we're going to do it. Anyway, we did get some papers in here. I don't know if they're relevant. Let's see, usually they're like instructions. Okay, it'll tell us how to put the, oh, it's spoiling what we got in every every uh, door. So it'll tell us how to put things together, which I will need, that's going to be handy. Now this calendar is, the numbers are not in order, they're scattered everywhere, but we can see, this is so pretty because you can see a little bit of everything that you can get. Well, I don't know if it's everything, but a lot of different things you can get. So door number one is up here. We're gonna go ahead and open it up. I know you guys can see the entirety of the calendar. There's some doors that are really tiny up at the top. I'm gonna try my best to show you guys as we go along. But the first door, of course, we got our first character. We have to get the first character. Now this is one of the girls here, whoopsies, with the dress. So here she is kind of just plain and then so you can have her plain because she looks really pretty um, but if you want to use the dress you want to take the dress apart or the skirt I guess I should say um, we'll take the dress up, skirt apart and then we got to put her together like so maybe no are we not going to there we go nope we didn't get this side all right there we go so she's in her little dress she does have a little doll she carries around, I'm going to assume. <laughs> and she has some bows. She got three bows to put on her dress here. So let's get those put on. Actually, where's the third one go? Or did we just get an extra? I think we just got an extra bow. So that's good that we got an extra piece. And I'll just put that over off to the side. But here she is, she's so cute. I like her a lot. And she has such a floofy little dress, I love it. So first girl is done. Now we're looking for door number two. Hmm. Door number two, I see three. Oh, here's two. Two is right here and we have, it's the puppy. That's so awesome. All right, so we have the puppy and she comes with a little bowl. We have a nice little pink dinner bowl for her. And here she is, she's just a tiny little thing. And then her head can move down and move back up. Isn't she cute? Oh my goodness. All right, door number, that's like the best duo. You know, you got the, the person and then you got the dog. That's all you need. Anyway, door number three would be next and that is right here, this big giant. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna just jump to conclusions and say it's the tree. I mean, oh, maybe not. What do we got here? It's a table. It's an entire table. All right, I, I was wrong. I thought the big one would have been the tree. Oh well. Let's get this table built. So we have this, this, I want to get these closer so you guys can see them a little bit better. So we have this um, purple, that's the word I was thinking, purple table. And we're going to go ahead and start building it, I think. Oh, can we do it this way? What are the instructions? Oh, I think the instructions told me to put this together first. 
That would have been the smarter thing to do. Whoopsies. It's okay. I'll make it work. I'll make it work. We'll get this together and then there we go. It's put together. It looks really pretty. I love the white, the purple, the blue, and the silver. It's just the color scheme of this is wonderful. So I'll put that off to the side while we open up door number four, which is right here. And of course, we have some silverware and stuff. I'm not going to open this up right now until we set up the ball at the end because I'll just end up losing these or spilling them everywhere. But we have plates, we have glasses, and then we have these little drinks to put in the glasses. So I will set that on the table. We'll set that up when we're looking at everything. So door number five is a chair, two chairs, three chairs, two chairs. Two chairs and door number five. And they have little cushions. Chairs have cushions, that's awesome. Are we gonna put the cushion on the chair? There we go, we got it. So it's a silver chair with like this purpley pink cushion. It looks wonderful. Like that. So we got two of those, two of those chairs. And I actually wonder why it didn't match the purple on the table, but that's okay. So door number six is actually up here. I'm gonna guess this is the tree, right? No, yep, it is, it is the tree. We have a beautiful white Christmas tree. Let's go ahead and get this out. Oh, the star came off. It's actually kind of rubbery a little bit. You guys can see it bends. Um, we're gonna put, I guess, the this one on first. Um, maybe I should look at the instructions just in case. And then this one will be next. And then the topper. Yeah, and then we have a star. So this is whole, this whole thing is like a little rubbery. It's on the rubbery side. Look at that. We have our Christmas tree. It's so cute. It has its bulbs on and some stars and some some of these purple things. I don't know what they're called. Just like re they look like little wreaths or lays just laid all over. All right. So door number seven would be next, and that is right here in front of us. What do we have? It's a present, isn't it? Ooh, okay. We have a present box and we have a doll. This is cute because it's a friend for her current doll that she has. We can go ahead and put that in our present box, close it up, and we're good to go. Oh my gosh, this is such a good present box too. I love it. All right, put that under the tree. <laughs> All right, door number eight is actually up here. Let's see if I can get this. Um, is it more chairs? Ah, more chairs. I was like, why did we only get two chairs? That's good. We got some more chairs. Two more to be exact. So let's go ahead and put these together. Ta-da. And one more chair. Oops. Ta-da. All right. Next. We need door number nine, which is here by the present. And we have, oh, it's dinner. We got dinner. Let's go ahead and get our dinner laid out here on the, on the table. Um, we have a knife for carving, and then we have the actual dinner itself, which doesn't really sit well in this platter. I think the neck is too long. I'm gonna go ahead and put that on the table with the knife. So then door number 10 is right here. Oh, this one is up. We have here. Oh, is it the kitty kitty set? Yes, it's the kitties. This is awesome. I love the little basket. So we have the basket here. It's a purple basket. And then we have this little blanket to go in, but the blanket is like a hard plastic and it's molded and it looks really nice. So we can go ahead and put that in. I think this is the way it goes. I don't know, probably could go a few different ways, maybe. I don't know, I think it's close enough. It looks so good and then mama can lay in there, take a nap. Baby can also come in here and take a nap, but she looks like she wants to run around. But look how cute, it's a mama and a baby at the ball. It's so amazing. We can put them under the Christmas tree, duh. All right, door number 11 is actually one of the ones you guys can't see, it's way up here. Super tiny, there's like three tiny doors at the top. And oh, we got a person in here. This is one of our little, uh, somebody in the band, we're gonna say. Looks like he's playing the recorder. 
Let's see if we can get his collar on here. Oh, let's see, is your collar gonna go on or am I gonna have to take your head off just to get this collar on? Come on, there we go. There we go, come on, <laughs> got it. And then he has his instrument here. So we're gonna go ahead and have him hold this. Whoops, or not. There we go. There's his instrument, he's ready to go. This is so cool. I'm gonna put him by his little friend over here. And we lost the turkey off the table. Next, <laughs> what door was that? 11, 12, we are looking for door number 12, which is right here by the tree. And we have, is this a sled? A sled, a sleigh, a sled? Oh, I lost something. What is this, isn't it? I think it is, hmm. Let's go refer to the handy dandy instructions. Okay, so this comes apart here, right? It doesn't come apart, but we use the string and we tie it, we get it through here. Oh goodness, this is gonna be a, an adventure here. Get it through here and then I guess, well, we could go drape it through that hole there, but what I'm gonna do is this. I don't know if this will be effective. No, that was not effective. It's effective for temporary purposes. <laughs> so it's like a little sled, and then they have this little handle. That's what I'm thinking it is anyway. That's pretty cool. I like that. Although they're inside most of the time, I don't know what they're doing. Anyway, <laughs> let me flip the page here. All right, we're looking for door 13, yes? Yes, 13 is right here. What do we have, what is this? Is this just a little decoration? I think so. Let's see, yes, it definitely is. So we have a vase and we have like a little branch and then we have these crystals to put at the ends of the branches the branches are like really flimsy, so you gotta be, <laughs> be careful. Um, I'll try here. There we go. And the masterpiece, the centerpiece is almost done, and it is. Ta-da! Really cool. And then, door number 14 is up here. We have, is this another gift box? I think it's another gift box of some sort, maybe. Or a gift bag. So, there we go, look at that. I think it's a gift box, I'm going to assume so. And we actually got a necklace in with this one, so, you know, they're getting a necklace for the gift. Ta-da! <laughs> All right, and then moving on to door number 15. We have that right here. Ooh, there's a little table and candelabra. Ta-da! I'm actually wondering why this is all translucent blue. Like, I should have painted the candles maybe or something. I don't know what's going on with that, but I like this little table. This would be good for our other centerpiece as well. And then door number 16 is actually way at the top. It's another one I want you guys really see. Oh, and there he comes. We have our little dude here. Um, it was just him. He didn't come with accessories or anything, which is weird because there's like a whole thing that he's playing on the picture. So I don't know if that's going to come separately, but I like him. He's really cool. I like his haircut and his, his outfit has snowflakes all over it. So he is dressed for the ball. He's ready. So moving on to door number 17. Ah, here we go. We got the instruments. We got the violin here. I'll have him hold it since he is the musician. Uh, let's go ahead and have him hold that. And he can hold his bow here. Ta-da, oh, ta-da. There we go. And then moving on to door 18, which is way down here. We have, oh, the music stand. Okay, so this is a three-part adventure. So we'll have the stand right here that we put together super easily and then just throw some music on the stand and we are good to go. 
Or does it, does it go that way? It's not setting very nicely. There we go. Okay, I know you guys can't really see this stuff very, very well, but I promise we will get there. We will we'll show you everything. And door number 19 is up here. have another gift another gift box let's get this put together and we have a music book inside that's cool close that up and next is door number 20 which is here right in the center. Oh, I did not want to come open and we have oh Yes, I didn't even realize we had a pet bird for the ball. I mean, why not? So go ahead and put his little stand together. And then we'll put the birdie on top. Ta-da! Oh my goodness, that's so cool. Why is this not focused? Oh goodness, sorry guys. Okay, it's focused now. Really cool. And then the next one is door 21. Hmm, 21 over here. something we got to build. I'm not sure there's like a teddy bear in here. Hmm, is it just a little table perhaps? I think so. I think it's just a teeny table. And then we have a little bear. So you can use that as a present or you can I guess put it on the table if you wanted to. And then let's see number 22. It's right here. Oh, we have some skis. You know, you gotta have the snow sports going on here. We have, I think they could, they should be able to fit on their feet too. So you can have that and then they have their, all their materials here. And then we have door number 23, which is another one that's way up at the top. It's the last one at the top, obviously, because we're almost at day 24. All right, what is in this one though? It is, it's such a small door, but apparently such a big thing. Okay, so we have the a present. I love the present boxes. So inside the present, we have a little sailboat, and we put it in here. I hope it fits. Yeah, it does. And it's just this really pretty silver and blue present. The last one we have here is actually door number 24, which is our last day, and we have our. Let me actually get this out of here so we can officially look at this. So we have our, I guess our hostess probably. She's probably the main guest. Uh, she's wearing a very beautiful dress. So let's go ahead and get her out. And we have to figure out how to put her together. Now here she is. Ta-da, I like her hair. Oh, does she have like little flat? Oh, you have to put cool little flowery things in her hair. Oh snap. Okay, let's see if I can figure this out. Shouldn't be too hard, right? And ta-da, look at her hair, it's so pretty. And then let's get this dress on her. So of course, you could have it without. I'm gonna have it with. Go ahead and put it together. Ta-da! And then we have an area for a bow back here. I love this, this is so pretty. And then, we're not done yet. We have this. I'm not sure how this works, actually. It looks like, oh, she goes on like this. Okay, I see. So we go ahead and put, her legs will stay still. I'm pretty sure we put her uh, this in between those two legs and then, actually I'm not sure how this works. I'm looking at the instructions, right? So it's showing us to put her on the stand like that. And I'm trying, but she's not like, I don't know if she's not supposed to like officially sit on, stand on it, or if she's just moving too much for me to be able to put her on. All right, I think I might've gotten it. Yay, we did it. And I think this one might be for our other girl, maybe possibly, possibly, because it is a smaller one. Yes, uh, but it's not, hmm. It's not gonna be able to make her spin though, because she's not, <laughs> 
it, her legs aren't long enough, so we have a little problem in that sense. Other than that, let's set up for the ball. Here is the Christmas ball all set up. Look at the Christmas tree. There's so many gifts under there. <laughs> and the table's all set with the dishes and everything. All the animals are cozy up in their little areas with the family here having a good time. I love it, it's so cool. This was such a fun calendar. Let me know in the comments down below which which item is your favorite. So which day was your favorite? Mine personally is the cat kitten bed combo that we got that was so cute i love it i love that little blanket in the basket it's so adorable i want to thank you guys so much for watching be sure to subscribe and i will see you next time